Homes where heart belongs. Pulling a room together and transforming the features to make it functional and stylish yet homely is not often an easy task. Whether you are renovating an entire house or adding a splash of color to freshen up a living room, these decorating pointers are not to be missed. Remember, it's your home. There are no rights nor wrongs in interior design. Everyone has the potential to design their own home. In this video, I am going to share with you guys 10 great interior design tips that helped me to transform my house into a dream home. Let's start. Be bold with paint ideas. Remember the single biggest canvas in our homes are its walls. So use paint to add color and drama to your walls. Paint a single wall in your room in color, keeping rest of the walls white. That's the tip which worked for me. You guys can see I have used little grey paint on this wall to add some drama. Nothing brightens up her home like a good fresh coat of white paint does. So if you guys don't want to add colors, consider giving your home a fresh coat of white paint. Use wallpapers on shutters. I have used wallpaper on the cabinet shutters in my living room. These are very easy to install and easily changeable and are cost effective too. I have used this 3D brick wall type wallpaper on my EB board. I have also given a makeover to this wooden cabinet to break monotony of brown in this space. As you guys can see, the door was also actually in brown color and all these cabinets were in brown color. So I wanted to make a difference and break the monotony of this space. Hence, I got the door painted and gave a makeover to this wooden cabinet. Paint your furniture. Give a new look to your old furniture by using a fresh coat of paint. Chalk paint is the best option for painting the furniture. I have shared few videos on giving a new look to your old furniture on my YouTube channel as well as on the Insta handle. I have even painted my puja mandir but I haven't used any patterns because too much of pattern will make the place look cluttered. Home lighting. Lighting plays a hugely important part in the look, feel and functionality of your home. You guys can see how my home looks with just the tube light on. Of course, we need tube light as it's the ideal light to study and puts less strain to the eyes. But to add good mood and to make your home aesthetic, add accent lights. These lights add drama to your space by highlighting a work of art or a particular area. You can always add some pretty lighting in your room using table lamps, floor lamps, pendant lights and wall lights. You can also use some add-ons like battery operated LED lights and candles to make the space look more attractive. Artworks. If you want to upgrade the look of any room, use unique decor elements. As you guys can see, I have painted and got help from the carpenter to get this painting framed in this pattern. This is one of my favorite DIY and this frame is the cheapest frame, only costed me rupees 100. This mask I got from a local shop in Chennai. I got this mask also from the same shop. 
I also have Buddha mask but I did not display it as it was a heavy piece. Make sure not to clutter your space by displaying all the decor elements. Instead, you can keep shuffling the decor elements when you get bored. This is the key because if you put all the decor elements together, it becomes really difficult to maintain them, especially in cities where the metro stations are being constructed, the dust is unimaginable. So having a few decor elements is going to help you to keep your home neat and clean. I keep the bigger decor elements as such and I keep shuffling the small decor elements as I get bored. Even the floor lamp acts as a decor element. You can also use books as a decor element. If you guys have separate reading space then you can use bookshelf to display some of the important books. Do not display all the books because the area is going to get cluttered and also it becomes difficult to manage. Instead of cluttering a wall with lots of family portraits, you can save money and get the full family portrait painted by an artist. Trust me guys, it will stand out in your room and all your guests will absolutely love it. Use plants. Plants are the cheapest, most easily available and prettiest decor accessories that ever exist, which makes them bestest way to decorate your rental. You can mix some artificial and real ones. I have mixed here because my home gets very, very less sunlight and also my balcony has two AC outdoor units. And my balcony also doesn't get much sunlight. So you guys can see I have added greens in almost each corner of my home. I have added artificial green mat in my balcony to make the space attractive. And I also have added few plants and decor pieces which are easily maintainable in my balcony. As I already mentioned, this balcony has two AC outdoor units. To cover them, I have used this bamboo fence. And I have used very easily maintainable plants because most of the plants died here in my balcony because of this AC outdoor unit. Use rugs. The rug completes a space by adding color and warmth. It also helps to differentiate our seating space and dining space. Since my living space is very small, I have just used this rug. It's one of the best and cheapest option for rentals. Get beautiful window drapes. The curtains play a major part in changing the look of the room. I have used one plain burnt orange curtain with printed curtain which I got from Shopper's Fortune. Many of you loved these curtains when I used them in my old living room makeover. These are my absolute favorite and they are very easy to maintain. Change the upholstery. I am showing you guys the difference my living room had after changing the upholstery. Can you guys believe it's the same sofa set? So giving a new look to the old furniture is always the best way to transform your home. These are very easily maintainable. I made sure there are very less patterns in my cushion covers and throw cushions because too much pattern makes the space clutter. As there are already patterns on my rug, I wanted very minimal work on my sofa covers. To break the monotony of my dining table, I got these covers stitched. All these covers are machine washable and are easily maintainable. 
the small seating my mom uses when she does puja. This cherapai I got from Amazon and I absolutely love it. You guys can see I have used burnt orange throw cushions here. So here is the bonus tip. Always have space to store all the things that you guys regularly use in your living space. You can do it in a decorative manner. As you guys can see, I have used this crochet cloth to cover these dirty wires of our intercom. Since our flat is 15 years old, there are some things which are outdated. These are the 10 great interior styling tips that help me to transform this house into my dream home. I hope this video was informative for you guys. If you guys liked it, do like, share, comment and subscribe to my channel. See you all in the next video friends. Until then, this is Swati Ganesh signing off. Bye bye friends.